let's learn how you can add your custom colors in your Apple Keynote. Here I am, Keynote for desktop on my Mac. Before we get started, let's just customize the toolbar at the top. So right click on it and select Customize Toolbar. Now we can drag colors to our toolbar. This way, it will be way easier for us to use that in the future. Take a look. Now we got colors in toolbar directly. I click on that. As you can see, I got my color wheel. We can use also sliders, whole palettes, spectrum, and even old school pencils. All of that is here. So if you pick the color you like, you can modify the brightness of it. And if you want to keep that color to keep using across this document or even in the future documents, you can add it to your mini palette below. So we drag this color and add to the palette. We can use the slider to do the same thing. I like to use hue saturation brightness sliders, this style. So the color will, the top one decide the color, then the saturation, how saturated the color is and the brightness of that color. And if I'm happy with it, I click and drag this to my palette. And now I can easily use that across my designs. So next time I add a shape, and they ask me to change the color of that. I can of course use the stock colors, but I can also click the color wheel. And instead of picking the color from the wheel every time, I can just use those colors we just save. So we save this one and this one before. It's also super handy if you already prepare a color palette. Maybe you download really cool color palette online. So let's grab this color palette from the internet we found on the internet and paste it here as an image first. All right, so here it is. I found this online. It's really nice and I plan to use it in my presentation. I can simply open the colors panel here. And now I can use the color picker tool, pick the first one, drag it to my panel, pick the second one, drag it here, third one, let's save it here. We got two more colors. And the last one, the dark color. All right. And now I can delete that because all of those colors from that palette are already here added to my swatches. And I can reuse them easily. Okay. So that's how you can add your custom colors to Apple Keynote on your Mac. I hope this was helpful. Let's watch the next Apple Keynote tutorial.